Good morning, guys. I am, well, brushing my hair now, as you can see, and I'll brush my teeth. But I want to tell you about this new skincare thing I've been doing. And maybe you can't even call it skincare. Maybe you can call it lack of skincare. But I've stopped cleansing my face. I think my face is clearing up. Maybe it's not, though. But I feel like when I was just using cleanser, it was too hard and rough on my face and it was giving me more face problems than I think it was helping. So I stopped doing it. I think it's getting better. I obviously still have a few, but I think it's better than what it usually looks like. I'm making my own chai tea now. It's chai tea, so that's what this is. Just prepping this. I have the chai tea that I made and then almond milk. Also, my chai tea makes noise in the morning. Can you hear that? I, it squeaks, don't know why. Not really sure what that's about, but anyways, almond milk. Creamer, I take this Chobani coffee creamer. Not coffee, but whatever. And I just put a day ish. Very yummy. Chad, do you want to try it? Okay. Such a stir now. Then for breakfast, I made Chad and me, Chad and I, I don't know, overnight oats. And I haven't done this before, so we're gonna try them. Mix it up a little. I'm going for first bite. A lot of chia seeds. Yeah, my only thought so far is too many chia seeds. Lesson learned. Um, not a lot of flavor. But I think I know where to go from here, so it was a good first one. Here it is. Mmm. Just looks super scrumptious. Add it just left to go home for the weekend, but something that we decided we're gonna do this week that I wanna share with you guys is that we are doing the 75 soft challenge. So if you don't know what that is, I have a, a lovely little thing I'll show you. For 75 days, Chad and I have to do these four things every single day. So drink three liters of water, exercise for 45 minutes, follow a diet of your choice, and read 10 pages of a book. My book that I'm reading right now is Harry Potter. So before I go do my exercise for the day, I'm gonna get my 10 pages done. Also, I've read Harry Potter before. I just, I don't have that many books here and I wasn't gonna go buy a new book for this. So I have Harry Potter that I'm gonna read 10 pages of. Then I'm gonna go for a 45 minute walk. And then the diet I'm following is just a, like a calorie deficit. Feeling pretty good. This is day, five I believe and I'm still going which I'm kind of impressed with myself about so I'm gonna change into my clothes here's the outfit for today wow this pink and blue Patagonia like this gray I think like Carhartt and then these gray sweatpants that actually are not mine and then Nike socks so let me put this on ready for this transition Cute, she's styling. She's actually gonna read. Um, so I might regret doing this in long sleeves and pants. The sun is really hot out and I guess I just wasn't expecting that because I actually don't know why I wasn't expecting that, but I wasn't. So I'm a little warm and I would say I'm probably like maybe five minutes into my walk. So 
We'll see how this goes. Maybe I'll get back and I have to take a shower. Oh, I thought that was a dark cloud. It's not just the sky. So, may I'll check in at a different part of my walk. The sun is to not be trusted. When I checked my weather this morning, it was what? Six, like, I don't even know, 62 degrees and cloudy. And um, can you see that? Not, not cloudy. It is sunny and it is um, 70 degrees. I am fucking sweating. I'm gonna have to take a shower when I get back, which is horrid because I hate midday showers, even though it's not midday. It's fucking 10, 15. But I'm 40 minutes into my 45 minute walk and I wanna die a little. But moral of the story, you can't trust weathermen because it'll just change. The weather just changes every day, every hour. It's never the same. I'm back from my walk. I've calmed down a little bit about the weather. I'm feeling better. I took a shower and I'm making lunch because it's 11.30 and I'm hungry. So I'll show you what I'm making. I have, well, I don't know if you can see in there. Anyways, that is my version of a chicken nugget right now. So it was just like a chicken breast. I cut up, I seasoned, I cooked, and then I put it in the fridge. And then when I'm ready to eat it, I take it out and I air fry it again and it gets all crispy. And it's so yummy. So I'm gonna have this and something else I think, but I don't know what else I'm gonna have yet. Here it is and it looks so yummy. It's a little hot right now, but. I shall try one of them for you. so good in crisis because I'm stupid and I should have checked earlier than now to see if I have like an outfit for the wedding and I bought these they're new so I hadn't tried them on either and the pants they're just like a little bit big so they're like falling but I so but like my other black stuff is dirty so I like have to wear these, but they don't really fit. So I'm gonna have to take the tags off. But they don't even, they have belt loops though. So maybe I can just buy a belt one day, but I don't own a belt right now. So the plan is I'm gonna wear this shirt, these pants, and then my heels. I'm gonna put one of my heels on. I also, oh shit. I also just repainted my toenails because I'm not allowed to have chipped nail polish on. So I gotta make sure it's good. It's pretty good with the shoes. I, God, I hope this venue's inside if I'm wearing pants. I'm going to attempt to do my makeup now since I have the shirt on. Also, I this is really harsh lighting. This is natural lighting, right? So it's not, as bad as it seems, I just need this on for my makeup. Oh my gosh, this makes me, ooh, that's okay. And I'm gonna try to be somewhat quick with this because I feel like I'm behind, even though I'm not really behind. You can see all of this. I also just washed my makeup brushes yesterday, so that will be good news for this. I also have apologies about this wedding. Um, they have a no photography rule. So I will not be able to take any photos of the venue and I will not be able to obviously then take any videos. So we will be in the car together and I can show you the outside of the venue. But once I get there, we're sadly going to have to part for some of the day, which I know it's supposed to be in the day, the day of my life and you're missing something, but we'll recover. It'll be okay. All I have to do with like this brush is like make sure it's covering everything kind of evenly. And then I'll use my beauty blender to 
make sure it's blended in. I'm really losing it about the outfit. I don't like it. I'm worried about the pants. I am a dumbass for not trying them on sooner. And I guess I'm just getting what I deserve. Luckily, today's not like the wedding. It's like a rehearsal dinner, I'm pretty sure. Or like a welcome. I don't know, it's not the wedding. So if I don't look great today, it's not the end of the world. I just have to make sure I look good tomorrow. I feel like this day is going by really fast, but it's not at the same time. Cause it's only like one, but my get ready time is between one to two. And then this like, why do my lips look so, like this is not how I, is it really all because of this lighting? Yeah, this is how I fucking look. That lighting's crazy. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh yeah, timing. Two to three is like me finalizing what time I wanna leave. And then like three to four is me driving to the venue. And then I have to be there at four. I'm pretty sure that's the math on that. I also washed all my brushes. This is supposed to be white, but I've used so much pink, it's like stained. All my brushes are also like still wet, kind of. Is that okay? I don't know. Do I look cute? Cutesy, cutesy. I feel like I could use more blush. Why does it look like I'm not wearing any blush? Huh? Can someone answer me that? Wow, she's gonna be shiny today. Please be an indoor venue. Please be an indoor venue. Please be an indoor venue. Is it? <gasps> oh, it's a crazy amount. Crazy amount of highlighter. We overdid it, team. We shot too high to the... We overshot it. We hit the sun. We've overshot the moon. We hit the sun. Wow. On this cheek specifically, I'm not sure why. Wow. It is really intense on this side. Well, if I take it off, that means I gotta take off my entire like makeup and I don't wanna do that. So we're just gonna be heavy on the highlighter, I guess today. Lesson learned, don't use that much. Here's the final makeup look. It is still heavy on the highlighter, but it looks much better in natural light than my mirror light. My hair is also looking so flat and it's also kind of greasy in the back. I don't know why, I watched it last night, so yay me. Now I, well, I have to go to the bathroom, so I might do that soon. And then I should probably eat something else before I leave, but I don't know what yet. I should get that figured out, make sure I have everything packed up, ready to go, and then go. And in an attempt to help it out, I'm gonna curl just these pieces. Even though my hair doesn't stay curled. What could go wrong? Come on, everyone get in here. We're gonna have some fun. Today, I guess it's just not my day. Makes sense, considering I'm on day two of my period. Those are known to be my worst days. So, it'll be okay. That's crazy, I know, but my hair actually like doesn't hold a curl anymore. It used to a lot when I was younger, it does not anymore. So that will calm down before I need it to like look, you know, normal. It has time. I'll do it this side. I'm in the process of like growing out the bangs or whatever the fuck you want to call them that I cut in October I'm trying to grow them out and it's a struggle because they're a weird length they don't really fit nicely in my ponytail yet but when they're out they look funny great now I look like I'm part of the fucking like Regency era of Bridgerton make heist I have to make haste. I have a ball later today. Why do I have like that accent? I have a ball later today. Oh, they're English. I have a ball later today I must attend. By a ball, I mean a wedding I'm working because I am just a peasant. I 
am just a peasant. I'm not scared, I'm scared. the idea. It looks a little cray cray. It looks, my forehead looks so big today. Why does my forehead look so big? Why does my forehead, oh my God. Why do I look like this? I need per perfume on actually before I forget. <gasps> Whoa, transition in the stomach. That's, I can't believe my camera just fucking fell. Your girl's stressing. I don't, I have to leave in like 20 minutes. Oh gosh, I have to keep talking. Curling these pieces may have been a mistake, but I am sure they'll fall before I need to be where I need to be. So I'm going to keep packing. It's actually, I'm back. I might be a genius. And by genius, I mean, I've used an invention that's existed for years. Let me introduce you to it belt so this is not my belt this is chad's belt and it's brown which also like does not go with this outfit and it's does not it's not working anyways so what i'm gonna do is just not tuck my shirt in and then you can't even see it and my pants are up one problem solved now it's just my hair that's the problem hey i'm in the car i'm gonna leave but I'm not going to like vlog on the drive. Well, because I don't know how to get there. So I need maps. So I'll be using that. And then maybe I'll check in once I get there. I guess we'll see. But if I don't, the event today is only like two hours. So I shouldn't be there too long. And then I'll drive back and we'll see where the rest of the night takes us. Honestly, I'm having kind of an eventful day. So this has been pretty good, I think. I kind of like the daily vlog. I don't know everyone else's thoughts on them, but I personally am having a grand old time. So that's exciting. Maybe I can keep making these and then I can like do more than one a week, perhaps. I guess we'll see how long it takes me to edit this. But honestly, if I could edit this, well, no, I'd probably have to edit it tomorrow and upload it tomorrow. Cause that's gonna, I don't know. I guess we'll see, but this is exciting. That is such an expensive wedding. Holy shit, those people are rich. Yeah, so the groom apparently has his own business. I did do my own research and I found out the business, but I'm not gonna reveal that for you guys. But so they have a no photography rule unless it's like their photographer and they can't like don't want it posted anywhere. So I didn't take any pictures or anything, which is sad because it was super cute. But tonight wasn't their wedding. It was like their before the day like party. So it's like all their guests like came anyways and they're just like living it up. And ugh, it's so nice. But no, everyone here is just so rich. I've never seen so many Porsches in the same parking lot in my life. Like my little Buick probably looks so pathetic in this parking lot right now. But anyways, I got dismissed at 6.30. So I'm gonna head back home, maybe make dinner. For dinner, I'm making salmon that's still partially frozen and bell peppers that are also still partially frozen. So I'm just gonna take my air fry pan, avocado oil spray, Pam style. Perfect and dump my salmon on here. We love a good 7.30 p.m. dinner, don't we? So I'm gonna take this bell pepper and put this on the pan as well. We're all, we're cooking all of it at the same time. I hope that's not a crime. I don't even like bell pepper that much, but it's like the only vegetable I have. Right now. We're going to put some paprika on this. Some of these are getting a lot of paprika, some of these are not, but that's fine. Paprika, Cajun seasoning. We're really loading this up. Onion powder, garlic powder, my new bottle. Oh, I'm gonna have to 
take the top off. Okay, that's off. How are we getting? Okay. Ugh. And with seasonings, I'm really a girl. That just goes for vibe. Perfect. And then last but not least, salt. You can do, give this just a slight toss. Okay, perfect. And then I'm gonna add a little honey and put this in the air fryer for, I don't know, like 15 minutes, so 400 degrees. And then I'll show you dinner later when I'm eating it. Guys, I'm so sorry. I was so hungry. I think I ate my dinner in two minutes, so you're not gonna get to see what it looked like final product, but it was delicious. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here for today just because there's not much else to do tonight. I'm gonna probably eat something else because I'm still hungry, take a shower, go to bed. I'm tired. So thank you for hanging out with me today and I hope you enjoyed and I hope you liked the daily vlog. And if you did, please like, comment, subscribe, tell me about it. And I'll see you guys next time. That was my wink. Better with this eye. Bye guys.